Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest 1. Last time we left off, we kind of made a whoops and went to a place that I don't think we're supposed to do yet. Well, I mean, we're supposed to do it, but like, we kind of went in underprepared. So, moderate sum, sure, I'll take that. And now we have armor that's going to heal us as we walk. Chainmail, as much as I loved you for a short time, you are pretty much worthless to me. So, our max is 16 crap. Well, we'll show it off when we get a hit next time. Uh, I will use the in though, just because I use a lot of MP I need enough the money. And I did gain two levels. I believe I was level 10 on the last part. I'm now level 12. Here's the stats, and yeah, that's a good enough look at those. So let's go buy some magical keys so we can just have more on the way. Not to worry about other stuff, mostly. Hello, old man. I always buy six of your magical keys. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, seven. Thank you. Goodbye. Uh, now I want to buy a torch. I know I said buying torches and stuff is useless in this game, but I'd rather not waste 2 MP every time I want to use a spell. Actually, does this have no item shop? No, you, you're a merchant, right? Yep, you are a merchant. Uh, I just want to buy one torch. Thank you. And it's not for the Dragon Cave, because now that we're strong, we can take on the Dragon Cave. Also, I do not want to talk to you. Shut up. We should definitely be strong enough to take on the dragon. The dragon doesn't hit that hard. And we can take on a wizard with, like, a level 12 stats. We can probably take on anything in the next coming area. So, let's get right to that. Sure, I uh, hindered my progress even further, game. That's fine. I don't have to worry about you whatsoever. Uh-huh. I'm sorry, you're meant to be scary how? At this point? So one damage, and we take one step. Okay, two step, two steps. So there were two steps, you gain one health back. I mean, that's better than using cure every, like, or heal every five seconds, roughly. Because you're paranoid like I am. Oh man, that's not fun. Uh, oh wait, this is up. This keeps around to that area. Never mind. I want to take on the dragon. You know, save the princess and all that. I just need to find the right entrance way. 33 damage. Oh no. 14. Once again, you're you're meant to be scary. You're, you're not. Alright, so here's the dragon's lair. Now we go down. Uh, take this. Take this all the way down. Oh, really? Oh, that's kind of dirty. You have to use a magical key to get into that every time. I thought that stayed on lock. I guess the only one that does is the king's uh, castle area. And now we gotta fight a green dragon! Just whack it. 13 damage, we get a crit. Let's, uh, oh, are we evenly speed? I don't wanna die. That's not what I wanted to do. That's definitely not what I wanted to do. Alright, cool. Okay. You're putting up a bit of a fight, good sir. Okay, that's close enough to pull healers one HP off. And there, victory is ours. 
950 experience? Wow, that's a lot more gracious than I thought it was. Hello, princess. At long last, someone has come to live right from my, uh, my plague. Brave hero, I am Gwendolyn, the princess of... Yeah, yeah, shush. Oh, great. You, you gotta be a bride of someone who defeats the dragon lord. Uh, lady, uh-huh. Yeah, I'm gonna have you. Also, why are you in my arms? It's gonna make it very hard to fight and hold my shield to protect you if you're in my arms. Okay, any treasures? Nope. Also, I do like the sprite that they did for this. Obviously, it's different from the NES game. That means you just fall behind you for the most part. And you, Princess, you are so lucky that I am a speedy character. Princess, you better freaking just not say stuff about me getting in fights every five seconds. Because if this is an ideal world, you would probably help me fight. 600 experience. I will smack this button for as long as I need to game. Don't get me started right now. Get her out of there, don't take damage. Needs that much MP, so I'm glad for that for the most part. Yeah. Yeah, look, look at you, you're just a tiny little slime. Trying to get along in the world, but you know, the world ain't exactly fair now, is it? Two gold. Man, remember two gold used to actually be a fair amount for us? Yeah, not so much now, huh? Okay. Thank you for dying, and let me go on about my very merry freaking way to save this princess from her own feet at this point. 30 damage. Hey King, I saved your daughter. Her rightful side. Yep. Hey, we got a present. Now this actually, actually yeah. this present that she gave us has very little use for right now. Unlimited use though. Hey King, uh, how? Yeah, I, yeah, I love her. Pump the other levels. So seven or three hundred seventy-five. Ooh. I mean that's workable. But we're gonna probably level up before the end of that dungeon. I'm gonna go back to. But I'm also considering something. Also, in time, I want to heal, please. Just my MP. Thank you for letting me stay. Also, you know what? I now that I know or remember. Eh, you know what? Useful, if you have anything useful to say. Not nothing that I can put on already. Oh, you're the. Oh, there's a bank in this game. I completely forgot about that ever existing in this game. I thought that wasn't until later. What? Where's the damn item shop? I thought there was an item shop in this game. Or this town. Wait, that's the weapon shop. That's the. Oh, there is an item shop. It's the next town I'm thinking of. I'm very smart right now. So. Going over here. Back to the dungeon now, because we're level 12 and we should be able to hold ourselves for the most part. And plus now I don't have to worry about, you know, if I lose a bit of HP, I could gain it back just by walking around for a bit. Hello, Bard. Hello, people. Hello. I don't want to touch any of you. I want you. Uh, I just want magical herbs up the butt, please. Now, 
Now, if I could buy multiple stacks of this, I'm going to try to avoid that. I just want to buy enough so I can... If I need, like, a dirt cheap heal, I'd rather just use that. Alright, I have six. Alright, so it's, it's, it's six. Okay. Just want to make sure... Open that little door again, because that's annoying, and I don't like how that does that. But old NES games always did stuff like that, sadly. So, the torch for this. So I did say south first, and then straight to the west, right? Or was it north first? It's north first, south. Ah! Yeah, I recorded that video, like, maybe 20 minutes ago. You think I remember this by now? But nope, not always the case. Not my memory, at least. North first, then south first. Hey, you did one damage to me. Congratulations! I'm gonna heal that back in, like, two steps. Uh-huh. And south. Uh, da, da. Hey, do dungeons stay a lot? Sure as hell seems like it. Nope. Okay, right, good to know. Yes, hello. Booga booga. Wooga booga 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 booga. Yeah, you ain't worth much to me. Sorry. Okay, you. Okay, so there's several passageways to go, but I'm gonna go the one that we were in prior. I don't know if that leads up to anything. Small. 61. Where beast drop. 40 experience, so we were at 375, I believe, so this should be. Somewhere in the 200, I believe. My math isn't horribly off. So yeah, we'll probably get to the 100 soon enough. That's stop fist fisting a wall or something. Like okay, you are the one that caused me a little bit of mayhem, and then I could take you out in one shot. Okay, lovely. Okay, so down. There was a room that looked way too conspicuous. It's just more or less how do I get to that room now? Oh no, I can't cast spells. I wasn't planning to cast spells against you, buddy. Thanks for the tantalizing offer, but you know, not my go to thing. Okay, so that's a dead end. Okay, so you do do a little bit of damage on the plan. Predicting half the time. Okay, so we're about a thousand. Oh, that's not bad. And then I go back to the one town and buy the uh, steel iron broadsword. Broadsword. Okay, and now 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 the enemies are starting to hit for a bit harder. Seventy-two. Also, just so I know for convenience sake, how much is evac? Six. So I was wrong, I thought evac didn't exist until Dragon Quest 2 or 3, but, you know, there it is. Oh, we got a great version of evac now. And you don't hit for that much harder, so I mean, you're not much of a threat. Okay, level 13. What do we get for level 13? Strength plus 4, um, the best. Agility plus 8, resistance plus 4, HP plus 7, MP plus that. And we got Z Wait, Zoom is in this remake? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that didn't exist. Until later in Dragon Quest, uh, the Dragon Quest timeline. Alright, so there's just a lot of things I thought didn't exist in this game. 27, okay. Okay, so we just went down the wrong path then. Oh, thank I didn't fall asleep. That would have been a nightmare. Yeah, this 
seems like the most logical place to go. Okay, that's showing a boss. Are we going the right way? Because this is telling me we're going the right way. Fall asleep. Okay, I think if you fall asleep is based off your agility stat. Or it's completely random, I do not remember. I know the agility stat has a couple things to do with, like, if the enemy spells hit you or not. But I do not know that for a solid fact. Victory. Okay, so nothing of importance here. Four damage. Were you doing five? I thought you were doing three damage on the last level up. Maybe you were doing five. So nothing important there. Spooker got the dice. Okay, hey. Okay, you are kind of on my nerves right now again. Mostly because of you and your magic shenanigans. Oh, this seems like we're going the right way. Oh, you have heal. Oh, you dirty. Okay, we could do this all day. I guess this heal spell isn't as great as ours. Uh, down again? Okay. Yeah, that's actually for a story. So, I'm gonna cast Cure or Heal just to experiment with something. Yep, that's all we needed. Okay, well, I'm gonna just be back. Or, you could boot me out of the town entirely. Okay, cool. Zoom. Oh, really? Oh, well, that's gonna suck. I wanna go back to the town and buy the broadsword now, because now we can actually progress with a lot of shenanigans. So, I think we are actually going to do a jump cut with this, just because sake of convenience. And I'm gonna just take some notes down, so I'll see you guys in a bit. This is gonna get annoying to edit. Thank God I'm gonna edit that in like a bit. Yeah, when all this is done, I need to done that tomorrow. Alright, so now we put in about. Okay guys, now we're back this town. Now we can just go here, do this, buy a weapon. And 
not that. Where's the bloody... There we go. Actually, is that even... Eh, it's decent enough. Yeah, I'll buy it. I'll buy it, game. Oh wait, do I have too many items? Crap. Uh, the Chimera Wing isn't really important to me. Chimera Wing. How to buy the Broadsword. And we'll just sell our axe because that's been very nice to us, but it's also now obsolete. Um, should I do a tiny heal here? What? Uh, I'll use it in here. Do myself a giant favor and just go to the zoom into the castle. Now, if I'm not mistaken, our level up should be significantly higher than I think it is. A thousand four hundred. Yeah, that's gonna be. I would have to sit down and grind for that. In all honesty, and I don't want to. But next time on Let's. Play Dragon Quest 1, we will be doing something a little maybe risky for me. We will be going down to the desert finally. That's been on our list for a while now, and there's something very priceless there that I think most people would want. So, I'll see you guys on the next part of Let's Play Dragon Quest 1. I'll see you wherever the hell I'm going.